Welcome to the project demonstration of Android Bluetooth control, AC uh, induction motor speed controlling. So here we are going to control the speed of this AC induction motor in five levels and that commands will be sent from the Android mobile phone through the Bluetooth. So the commands will be received by this HC05 Bluetooth module and they will be given as input to the PIC 16F73 microcontroller and based on the characters received from this HC05 the system will control the firing angle to the uh, BT136 triac board. So here uh, the commands are like 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 total 5 levels 0 is the low speed means nothing but off and 4 is the high speed so here the system will detect the uh, when uh, this has to be controlled the speed of this motor through this zero crossing detector so here the purpose of the zero crossing is so whenever the AC waveform starts and the positive off cycle start then only we need to regulate the speed to the uh, AC induction motor by controlling the on time through this BT136 triac so means whenever the AC waveform starts based on the character received for example if it is set for 0 so whenever the AC waveform starts from the zero crossing detector then the system will off the triac for that particular off, uh, on time of the AC signal so whenever the we, we send the character of 4 to set the high speed then the microcontroller will on the full time of on signal so AC waveform has the like on uh, positive waveform, uh, waveform and negative waveform so based on this signal from this one if you want to go with the low speed means 50% speed then on time is given for the motor through the triac is 50% on time and remaining 50% off time so that we can control the speed of the AC motor by controlling the voltage to that so here the power flow is 230 volts AC inputs we are providing to the transformer and to the motor through this BT136 triac board and uh, the transformer will step down the 230 volts AC to 12 volts AC and that is input to this regulated power supply board so it has a three stages these four diodes will act as a rectification to convert the AC to pulsating DC capacitor remo to remove the pulses and will get the pure DC of 12 volts but the operating voltage of our microcontroller is 5 volts so we need to regulate that 12 volts DC to 5 volts DC with the help of 7805 regulator so after that the 5 volts is given as input to the uh, this motherboard so then it start reading input from the bluetooth module and when we provide that uh, commands to the bluetooth module then it will take the input from this zero crossing detector so on this zero crossing detector we can see the the black color ic is a bridge rectifier so this is the ic version of bridge rectifier and this is the diode version of bridge rectifier so the input to this ac parallel frame uh, some, uh, from this 12 volts AC and it will convert that AC to pulsating DC and that pulses is input to the transistor as you know the transistor trigger voltage is 0 0.7 volts then the transistor will get switched on so when it is on control will get the pulse so means when the AC waveform starts transistor will get switched on and the transistor will trigger the same to the microcontroller so as the AC waveform is started so then it will uh, control the AC waveform in the duty cycle means 50%, 25%, 75% and 100% and 0% so that will be uh, based on the commands received from this HC05 Bluetooth module so on this triac board we can see the uh, optically isolated diac that is uh, like uh, MBOC3011 is diac 1 and this will get the trigger for pulse from the microcontroller and that will be given as input to the triac board so triac will switch the motor so here the switching sequence is microcontroller will trigger the diac diac will trigger the triac triac will trigger the AC motor so let us see demonstration before on the kits we need to install the AC05 uh, application from the play store this is the icon available in the play store after installation that on the power supply to this right so after that go to bluetooth settings in your phone so it will be connected already I will unpair that right so this is only first time setup we need to connect to the bluetooth from the settings initially so once we pair from this one no need to pair it again the next is time ok and now open the application here we can see SC05 so initially it will display the btn1 btn2 btn3 just when you click on that 
So the BTN one will be there, and uh, the command is empty. Then we need to enter one, one. It will be like this. Then deselect these two and save. So remember, two two deselect save like that zero to four. So when we send the four character, let restart this. And now pair it from here. So connected. So four is full speed. Three, two, one, zero. One. So we can see the characters which we are going to send from the mobile phone. You can see on this terminal one. So here in this manner we are going to regulate the speed of the AC motor by using the triac and based on the Android mobile phone Bluetooth inputs.